you guys. It is currently about 10.25 at night. I ended yesterday's vlog or today's vlog about 20 minutes ago. Currently heading to the airport to pick up Casey. As you can see, it's dark outside. It's kind of weird starting a new vlog, even though it's nighttime. It's kind of weird to do that, but I'm excited for it. So she landed about five minutes ago. I'm about 10 minutes or so away. By the time I get there, she should be a baggage claim. It all should work well. I'm already, like I'm, I haven't seen her in about a month as well as her graduation, but I am so, so crazy excited. And tomorrow is the big day, as you guys know, for the last vlog. I am just so excited. So we're almost at the airport now. Gonna go pick her up and then head back home. It's gonna be kind of a late night, getting up early tomorrow, but I'm excited, I'm hyped up with this girl. Let's go get her. There it is, MCO. Look at this tunnel. Why do I not have an exhaust the Mark V? Killing me. Resident delete soon? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Every time I drive this, all I hear is Tokyo Drift music in my head. It's all I hear. Just slide in the corners, just slide in the corners. Made it and we're parked. If you guys remember last time I went to Dallas a while back, I parked in literally the exact same spot as last time. My corner spot went from everybody else. Literally perfect. All right, let's go. Let's go. Yo, the airport at night is dope. There's just nobody here. Ugh, yeet. Let's go. So made a baggage claim. I need to find American Airlines wherever that's at, and then we'll be in shape. I don't see it here. There's a huge group way on here, so I'm guessing that's my spot. I hope. Maybe I'll get lucky and I can sneak up on her. That'd be nice. There's so many people right now. So this is American here, but I don't see her, so she might not be off the plane yet. Look! 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 I found her. Girlfriend. I found her. I've almost had a constant scene, but I found her. We're all good. So apparently I walked past her like three times and I didn't did. see her. I'm gonna review the footage. I filmed this whole section and we'll see. Footage Stop it. Okay, well, we found her. So these are Casey's two carry-ons. And apparently she has like 10 bags or so. So this will be fun trying to get them all. Bag number three acquired. We're still missing like five apparently. It's gonna be a long... The, the, the pink one's yours? Yeah, it's really good. Let's better, 65 oh, pounds. Better, Here's number four, coming in at 65 pounds. Look at our look at our stack for one girl so far. Here comes number five, also a million pounds. And last but not least, number th this. This is all you. Like I live there. This is true, like, but like, so that's a lot of bag <laughs> Look at my big fancy bag. Jeez! <laughs> Go get him. So these are pieces oh. of what's left of the GTI grill that she saved. Literally in pieces. There's still, as you can see or not, there's a deer hair all over it still. And that's on my bed. We have poor, poor, poor GTI. Oh goodness. Gonna call it a night. I still have to edit today's video. Not even this video, last video. I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, good morning, you guys. Gotta talk really quiet. Casey's right there getting ready right now. I don't want to hear me. But we're getting ready for our, uh, our couple's photo shoot we're doing on the beach with Joey. Um, she has no idea what's happening. I have the ring in my camera bag. So I'll never suspect it because I always have a camera bag with me. So she won't think about why there's a photographer there. She won't realize why I have a camera bag. It's going to be perfect. I'm so excited. So we're leaving here about 10 or so minutes. Heading to Sebastian in the middle of Joey. And then uh, we'll see how it goes. Also, Larry Starbird's here. Haven't seen his car in quite a while. I think he left the Jetta, the TDI at his dad's house. He brought some. Haven't seen this thing in a minute. Miss this car. Oh, good morning, Sunshine. You ready? Excited? So cool. Made it to the state park. Never been before, but it's actually really, really cool. Right here under this bridge, there's a pier that way, a little like uh, beach section over there. Joey's M3 is here. Joey's somewhere this way to go find him. But it's time to go take some pictures. My man, Joey. Uh, I appreciate it. Thank you so much for coming out here today. Yeah, of course. It's been a while, dude. You, Since one to go How's fast. It going? That's so extremely windy out here. The water is like crazy crazy blue crazy nice it's super windy joy's about to taking pictures i'll put the camera down for a little while check my hand in just a minute first spot is done we're actually on the beach now a really awesome spot got the pier the rocks over there the sun's coming out perfectly it just looks it looks so so nice beach section is done for now i'm literally soaked didn't plan on getting wet yet she's soaked and sandy but i think i'm good good pictures joey yeah good Awesome picture so far. So on to our next spot. Yeah, I feel like a, like a dirty hobbit right now. Fuck with no shoes on. I'm, all, I'm gross. Sandy. Wind hasn't died down literally at all. Back at our second beach stop here. Gonna finish up here and then call it a day. But it's been awesome so far. Joey's got amazing pictures. My man does awesome work. I don't know if you can hear me now. It's really windy. But after this, food 
and then maybe some car stuff. Holy crap, my lens is little. It's so look at it, it's like straight covered in like salt and nastiness. But Joey got pictures. Hey, I was doing just fine before I met you. I drank too much and that's an issue, but I'm okay. I messed up, had the camera facing the wrong way because I wasn't paying attention. But look at where's it? I can't really see, but ooh. Boom, and she said yes, thankfully. So this is a good day. Got a ring, my man. I yo, thank you so my much. Boy getting married, yo, though. thank you so much for the pictures. I'm excited, we are excited. She had no idea, she was so surprised. I started crying. Ah, uh, I'm winning. <laughs> so right now she's making phone calls to her parents, her friends, all that stuff, freaking out. Like, everyone knew but her, which is kind of hilarious, so now she's kind of mad at everybody, also happy at the same time. It worked out so so well. Seriously, yo, thank you so much. This happened to work out so well. Like I don't even know. Like she crashed the car, came last minute, and it's worked out so so well. He happened to be in Melbourne. Literally all perfect timing. This is crazy. I'm mad. I put the camera in the wrong direction. I, I forgot to move it actually. I'm still recording this the wrong way, but it's all gone well. So now we're gonna probably get some food because we're starving. A beach day, and then we'll see what we do today. But your boy's engaged. No, I, need, I don't have a ring though. I need a ring. Hey! You helped pick it out? Find me? Oh she yeah. Picked it out? Oh yeah, she's upset. She's a little salty right now. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get yelled the rest of the day. I'm gonna get yelled out the rest of the day. <sighs> Alright, Joey's out of here. He's a busy man. Thank you so so much. Also the car stuff for sale. Someone buys M3. Yeah. It's nice. Yeah. Someone take it, please. Alright, man, thank you. Alright, right, so we're done right now. She's still on the phone, more people freaking out because I told a lot of people, but not her. So she's kind of upset. I think the plan now is to get food. Oh yeah, she's she's losing it right now. Absolutely. <laughs> So, gonna get food oh soon, God. and then just see what the rest of the day does. Uh oh, I'm just feeling good. I'm feeling so excited. I'm so glad she. Oh, how does he like? <laughs> Bring it. Later, man. But before anything else happens, I have to get cleaned off because, like, I'm like a nasty, dirty little like hobbit right now, and I don't like this. And I want to get my car. Literally, I was so covered in sand, but it was worth it. She's happy. Let's take some pictures today. Ah, she had no idea. That's so funny. All right, let's get cleaned up. Let's get out of here. All cleaned up and feeling a million times better now. To get, oh yeah, shut it off. Shut off. He's <laughs> been calling everybody. Stop, Time to get food. I'm literally starving. I love the beach. It looks so amazing, like pictures and stuff. But like the sand, it'll get you. My camera's still, like sticky and nasty. I had a like sticky feeling, but well worth it. So food time, and then we'll continue with the rest of our day. I spy some rotiforms way over there in the Civic. So Casey's done nothing but talk about Panera for yes. months and months and months yes. because there's but no Paneras in San Angelo, like, we so we had to go in. We're in this like very weird like. Like this back room. It's like the meeting room. It's kind of it's kind of weird. Got to upload today's video. The food is here. If you come into Panera, if you come here and you do not get broccoli and cheddar soup, I don't know what you're doing. This you have to have to have to get this soup. It's literally the best soup in the whole world. If you haven't, it's, it's the best. It's literally the best. Back at the house now. My attack dog is losing his mind. Yeah. Look at look look look. His little nose. Stop barking. Not sure the plan for us today. We have dinner tonight at like seven at a hibachi restaurant. My car is filthy. Might need a bath. I want. I kind of want to finish up the lip on the car. Not quite sure. Let's see what we do. Oh, no idea. Oh, what the? Ah. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Oh, you didn't know she was here. We invited her family. She had no idea. What's up, man? She had no idea. So today has been ridiculous and amazing. It is so, so awesome so far. Casey had no idea about the engagement with me proposing to her, and it turned out literally perfect. I'm still upset I missed filming it, but we got an amazing pictures from Joey. So again, thank you so much, Joey. Um, she had no idea her stepmom and her brother were coming up. Actually, that was a plan from this morning. I've been texting them back and forth all day long. So they drove three hours from Fort Myers just to come here today, so that's very awesome for them. We're seeing here her actual mom and her real dad or her stepdad tomorrow in St. Augustine. We're going to be all over the place, but it's been a busy, busy day. I don't exactly know what else I'll film for today and what else we're doing because um, I don't want to be on the camera all day long, but I want to keep you guys updated what's going on and just kind of share my life experiences with you guys, what these vlogs are all about. Uh, it's, it's just fun. I don't know. I mean, I'm super excited. We're going to dinner later. I'm probably going to take Miley because she likes to drive in the car. So we'll take Miley out. I, I might finish that lip because I don't know if I want to take the car out with that, that lip look like that. Like, it's not... It's not quite done yet, so maybe I'll paint that today and finish up the side and get it looking all nice and right before Miley goes out. Or just the VR6 one back in. I don't know. One other, but I will update you guys later on before the dinner. So a few hours have gone by. Uh, my sister's and Casey's brother at the park. My mom's getting ready for dinner later on. Casey hanging out with her mom. So everyone's kind of doing their own thing. I'm 
ready to go because I'm a guy and it's easy for me. So while I have this last hour, hour and a half to do things, I'm gonna get the lip on the car, the corners cut and the lip painted. I'm not gonna heat up and mold the corner. Maybe I will. I don't know quite yet, but I'm gonna get it mostly done until I take the car to dinner. At least the lip's fitting and not, you know, not that because I don't like, that's awkward. That, that I don't like that at all. So I'm gonna pull it off, get it painted, get it trimmed up on the side and it's looking, looking better. Then maybe wash the car too because the car is filthy. We'll see. In other life events, this also happened today. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Literally, my wiper fell apart today. Like, bleh. cheap. And while we're on the topic of the Cooper lip, while I'm still messing with it, trying to fit it on my car, um, people have asked me, is the Vento Vera 6 lip now for sale? It is not. It's mine. It was hard to find. It was expensive. You cannot have it. It's OEM and it's mine. Mr. Tyler Krieger, you can't have it. I'm sorry, I know you want it, but it's too bad, it's too bad. I will have all the lips. Actually, I won't have all the lips. I don't even think I'm gonna use this Cooper lip. I'm just having fun with it right now, but the VR6 lip, the Vento one up there, the OEM one, yeah, that's OEM goodness, that's mine, sorry. See you watching me up there. So I just said I am gonna wash Smiley. I'd have, I gotta have, gotta have both the legs looking good, you know? So the easy way possible, took some painter's tape right here, just lined up my bumper, uh, taped it off, so I'll just cut this section off, but it should be in good shape. Look how awkward these cars look with no lip. Like, look at that. Like, it looks just so awkward with no lip. Ugh. Always, always, always make sure you mark there's a lip. I don't care what lip it is, make sure there's something there. Got the first one cut here. Super easy. Just grab my little, my little snips. Chop, 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 and we're all done. So one more to go. Then we can paint it, and then back to the, back to the car. Also, you guys know my the, the famous paint booth is all set up, ready to go. Also, keep in mind while I'm trying to fit this lip to my car, um, one is not only to my car, and two, this lip has some damage. Like if you just look right here, like this section here is really bent. Like you hit the curb or something, like this all scraps up. So I'm kind of working with that as well. So like these corners are like not necessarily exactly where they're supposed to be in the first place. So eh, we'll see how it goes. Lip is now done and drawing and looking literally a million times better. I'm telling you guys, trim and bumper paint literally all of your plastics, all rubber. It makes it look, look at that, it's like brand, brand new. I mean, minus the scratches and everything. Like, other than that, it's looking brand new and color wise. But now, while that dries, we're gonna wash this dirty car. I still cannot believe this bird pooped in my car. It hit the back of the car, hit there, hit the back windshield, hit the roof, hit the roof, hit the roof. There was on the windshield and then down my fender. Like, whose man is this? Unbelievable, but the car's already cleaned, but it looks so, so much better. We'll throw our freshly painted lip back on. This so looks. The car is all washed and clean, looking a million times better. It's about 6.13 now, leaving at 6.30, cut a little bit close. So I got about 17 minutes to get this lip back put back on. What did I just say, English? I got about 17 minutes to put the lip back on the car, and we'll be heading out. Now let's pray it doesn't rain, because like it's not looking too, too happy in the sky right now. Currently 621 with nine minutes to spare before departure time. The lip is back on the car. I have to say with it being painted, it looks it looks so good. Look at, look at that. It looks so, so good. With the corners on the side here actually fitting properly, not sticking out like crazy. That side looks good. We'll come check out this side real quick. Ooh, bam, that lip fit looks nice now. The corners are still a little bit weird. Didn't have time to mold those, but honestly though, some paint, some cut corners. It looks pretty, pretty good. If I took some time to actually fix this side and that side, this thing would be pretty mint. And also, like I said before, this lip had some weird like dents and bends and like scratches in already. So I found one of these Cooper lips that was in like mint condition. It probably fit a lot better than this one does. But as of right now, I'm a fan. Don't know if I ever actually run it or not, or ever get my VRC Vento lip, but for right now, I like it. Ooh, 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 no. ooh. You know you know what's crazy? I no longer have a girlfriend. I have a fiance now. I have a beautiful fiance. Is that crazy to think? It's absolutely insane. So we're at dinner now. It's a mix of our celebration for us and my sister's birthday next week. So we're doing it all together. There's a bunch of people here. I might not film too much, but I'll kind of show you the overall, but it's a big group. I almost backed the car up and aired out right here. See, I'm not on the street for no parking. I would've been on the sidewalk. It would've been fine. Would've been fine. So we're going to Mizu with a Japanese steakhouse. More hibachi. I feel like every time we're together, we go to hibachi. It's just too good. Look, it's my grandpa. And look, it's Larry. Larry else is here. Yes. It never gets it never gets old. Fill her up, fill her up, fill her up, fill her up. They never get old. Fill it, fill it, fill it. Then dead. Oh. Almost got his hand in there. Yes. 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 
Okay, last stop of the night, we're at McDonald's over here in Lake Nona, meeting with one of Casey's friends that she's known for a long, long time since UCF. So we're at McDonald's right now, getting Irish women to show for a little while. You know when girls get a ring, they gotta show literally everybody. She's so excited, it is, it's like the cutest thing ever. So, hang out for a little while, then head back home. We have a really, really, really early morning. It was early this morning, being at the beach by like 8.30, and now tomorrow we gotta be at the Sunrise Service for church for Easter at like 6 in the morning, and I'm literally gonna die. But we're having a good time, so it's all fun. I lied, this is the actual last stop of the night. The gas station, I haven't filled up this car since air to water like two months ago. That's actually, that's so sad, I feel this car so little. But look at how this car sparkles under these lights. These gas station lights, literally best thing in the whole world. Like, look how good. Oh, she looks so good. And the lip, and the lip. And look, look, look. I got a fiance right there. I have one of those now. I do, I have one. I got a sparkly car and a fiance. Life is good at the moment. Life is very good at the moment. Okay, finally back home after literally one of the longest yet absolute best days of my entire life. I'm just excited. I'm super, I don't know, I'm just super excited. It feels like, I don't know, kind of like you're floating. This is one of the, like literally the best days ever. So thank you guys so, every one of you guys, did congratulations, all that. Thank you guys so, so much. Uh, Joey, again, thank you for making it literally a perfect experience with all the pictures and all that kind of stuff. Uh, thank you for being so beautiful. So, <laughs> uh, it's currently almost midnight. We're going to be up at like 5 a.m. to be at the church thing by like 6.30. Then I have to sing like 15 songs in a row. I'm really going to die. But I think after that, we're going to the beach and then up to St. Augustine. So it's going to be a busy day tomorrow. I'm on like no sleep as it is right now. But thank you guys so much for watching as always. Be thankful for every single day. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace out.